So guys, since last time when I made, when I cooked beef, I received quite few people complaining how I deprose the beef. So I didn't know because I really grew up, you know, I grew up that we always like soak a frozen food to the water, directly to the water and not inside a bag, a plastic bag just like this. So now I know, thank you for for telling me that this is a proper way in the frozen food, food. I mean frozen food. Oh my god, my son is crying. Del just woke up. I'm going to put him to sleep again. I think he's still sleepy. So since um I'm already back home, our summer class is it's already um we had our finals oh. yesterday. And right now I'm just home and my son is not he just woke up and he's not feeling so good. I mean He's not in the mood, so that's why he's crying. So anyway, I have, I'm going to cook beef again, but I'll try my best to just, not to overcook it. And also the owner of Fantasy, he's a friend of Timoy. He, he taught me how to cook it properly it's because he's a chef. So anyway, let's just wait for the beef to get the pros. And well, while waiting for that, I'm just going to prepare the side dish for our beef. So this will be our side dish. I got some baggy bean, beans, and then some baby corn. And also some, some baby potatoes. I'm just going to prepare it and I'm going to, to um, show it to you later. The finished product. So guys, this is what it looks like. Well, um the corn this corn later we're going to because there's no space we'll cook the baby corn later. so i prepared um two beef for timoy because he didn't eat any lunch i already put some pepper and some salt in it and i already reheated the pan so i'm just going to put it there and finish cooking Timoy's beef it it's two beef one two and he told me that to cover it with few foil and just to leave it out for probably like eight minutes but my beef is right here it's um let's just cook my beef because I'm also kind of hungry and I already This is the finished product for Timoy's um, dinner. I got the beans right here, potatoes. But unfortunately, my husband doesn't like the baby corn. So I'm going to eat the baby corn myself with baby dill. And let's just give it to him because he's hungry. Wow. I think I took it perfectly this time. Are there teachers with blue hair? Who made me wear these stupid pants that are too big for me? 
<laughs> You're lo you lost a lot of weight, Timo. It used to really fit you. So this trip, guy, I'm not very happy about it because my dog died. I cried a lot earlier. We just arrived to the hotel, we're just checking in and it's already 12 in the morning because um, our flight was one hour delayed earlier and tomorrow I have to wake up at 7 in the morning, actually 6 in the morning because I have to do the physical exam. So we'll see tomorrow. Luggage. It's so funny guys because earlier I asked Timoy to wear that pants because he looked good. I just really like him wearing that pants but unfortunately I didn't know that he lost so much weight. And he told me that he looks like a gangster. <laughs> he was using My his nose sword. has been running like Niagara Falls. I'm used to the province air and you bring me to the city and I get all messed up. I'm not used to it anymore. I can't take the smog. We were at the Tacoban Airport. The, it looked like the air cons had never had their filters clean, and I'm just in there just sneezing up a storm. Yeah, it was really dirty. Yeah. Is it this way? Oh. I think so, yeah. City Garden. Love very cheesecake, Tim. I think this is the buffet area. This is where I'm going to eat breakfast tomorrow. Chrissy, why are you making me wear these pants? I look like a gangster rapper. <laughs> I mentioned it. <laughs> <laughs> why are you making me wear these? <laughs> I really didn't know. I seriously, Timoy. I, I look ridiculous now with these things on. They're like they used to fit you. They're like 1980s jams. Do you, know <laughs> what those are? you don't even know what those are. Before your time. What's our room number? This room doesn't have any numbers. We're down at the bottom. Really? Oh, yeah, it's down there. Oh. She was there. She's no one's been in this room since the 90s. Stuffy in there. We are now on our way to the hospital for my physical health exam and it's just raining cats and dogs since last night. So I'm just done with my physical exam. I was told that I'm just going to wait for the, for an email or, or a call so that they can tell me when I can go back. So right now, I'm just heading to my room. And on my way here, I was really wondering where I was supposed to go because I forget my way on my way here. So I just Google map and I was to figure out where I, um, so I was able to figure out the, the hotel. So anyway, I'm just really, really tired and sleepy. <laughs> I might just sleep for probably like four hours, I'm not sure. Timo is already in our room and I have some um, receipt here in my bag, I mean this brown envelope. 
So I'm going to explain to you guys the process later.